So the second question of the chapter matrices and determinants from mathematical methods for physicists by Afkin, Weber and Harris. The question says, test the set of linear homogeneous equations x plus 3y plus 3z equals to 0, x minus y plus z equals to 0 and last 2x plus y plus 3z equal to 0 to see if it possesses a non-trivial solution. In any case, find a solution to this equation set. So before we solve this equation, let me introduce you guys to the concept of linear homogeneous system of equations. Let's say we have a set of equations say a1 x1 plus a2 x2 plus a3 x3 equals to h1 b1 x1 plus b2 x2 plus b3 x3 equals to h2 and last c1 x1 plus c2 x2 plus c3 x3 equals to h3. So this is a set of equations that we have. So if all hi's that is h1, h2 and h3 equal to 0 then the system of equations is known as linear homogeneous equations okay now let's move to the solution part or well, before we move over that so let's have a determinant of the coefficients so so from this set of equation the coefficients are a1 a1, a2, a3, b1, b2, b3, c1, c2, c3. So we will have a determinant of these coefficients over here. So this determinant will look something like a1, a2, a3, b1, b2, b3, c1, c2, c3. Okay. Now we have condition for this see case 1 if our determinant d is equal to 0 then there will be one or more than one solutions to equations which are at 0 and arbitrary to scale. Now our case 2 our determinant is not equal to 0 then the only solution the only solution we have is trivial solution now you guys might be having uh, difficulty what with the terminology of trivial solution so the trivial solution is something in which all the values of the variables so over here we have variables say x1 x2 and x3 these are the variables that we have over here so in trivial solution all the value all the variables have value 0 so that are x1 x2 and x3 are 0 so now let's come back to a question for solution so let us first arrange the equations in the format like this x plus 3y plus z equals to 0 x minus y plus z equals to 0 and 2 plus 2x plus y plus 3z equals to 0 okay now we will form a determinant for from the coefficients that we have so the determinant will look something like 1 3 1 1 minus 1 1 2 1 3 okay 
now we will solve this particular determinant and get the value and get its value sorry so we have a 3 over here so this changes to so the value of this determinant will look something like star so the value of this determinant will be calculated using laplacian development by miners so if you have not seen the previous video how to calculate the determinant please go to the description box and uh, you will find the link to the previous video where i have taught how to solve the determinant okay so the determinant will be like 1 minus 1 to the power 1 plus 1 minus 1 1 1 3 plus 3 minus 1 to the power 1 plus 2 1 1 2 3 plus 3 minus 1 to the power 1 plus 3 1 minus 1 2 1 1 so we get it as 1 minus 3 minus 1 minus 3 3 minus 2 plus 3 1 plus 2 so solving this particular algebraic form we will get 2 as our determinant so we can see that our determinant d does does not vanishes So our d is not equal to zero. Okay. So this is a very important point. From the previous slide, using the case two over here, we can say that the only solution that we have is a trivial solution, which implies that we have trivial solution. So the solution to our equations is. x equals to y equals to z equals to zero. So that is our final solution, and we have test the linear homogeneous equation that they does not possess any non-trivial solution. So thank you for watching the video.